Mike Stewart here with Test Products International. This is a demonstration of the SP565 Hotwire Velocity Meter. This works with the TPI View app. Of course, that's a free download on iOS or Android devices. Open up the app. Scan for the device, SP565. Now this screen is our setup. We can put our uh, our ducts uh, dimensions in there so you can calculate our CFM. You can put return or supply, rectangular or round. You can choose your units of measure, so cubic feet per minute or cubic meters, uh, Fahrenheit or Celsius, and of course your velocity units are adjustable too. Now there's three ways of uh, doing a measurement. You can do a single reading, you can do a multi-point averaging, or you can do a timed average. Now the timed average, I like this because you're doing more readings, and of course the more readings on average, it's gonna be a more accurate reading. Now we got our five holes here to do our traverse uh, measurements, or drilled in the correct spots. Extend your probe, this is directional, there's an arrow on it that marks the direction of the airflow. So I'm gonna go into the first hole, Start my test, keep it as straight and as level, and keep your speed consistently. Get to the end of the probe, you pause your test. Go to the next hole. Continue. Pause. Fourth hole. Continue. Now that I've taken my measurements from the five holes, I can stop the test, create report, put in my reference, and now it's giving me my duct dimensions, uh, GPS coordinates, date and time stamp, proof that it was done, and right here I've got my 398.13 cubic feet per minute. And again, save this to the job, Mike Stewart, and it's ready to email at a future time.